hey guys in this video we are going to see how to do the changes for Belkin router or Belkin Wi-Fi we know that Belkin is a powerful router it will support more systems with high configuration with high speed so to configure this just you have to open your browser internet browser and paste it the IP address 192.168.2.1 this is the default IP address just you have to paste it and hit on enter and you can see here the internet uh, status it's connected already the internet status is uh, connected so if you wanted to log out you can log out from here and you can disconnect and you can connect we will go one by one all the steps we will see here you can see here uh, the default IP address and when it comes to LAN settings here I have IP address and subnet mask and IP pool starting address uh, in this video we are going to see complete step by step things complete step by step all the settings and password changes each and every step very clearly so IP pool uh, starting address IP pool ending address and local domain name if I go down again DHCP client list if you look at here how many people you have connected to your Wi-Fi router you you can see complete details over here and internet w a n if you go to dynamic again here uh, you can mention your host name and static ip address if you go to uh, internet van and uh, if you look at here you can make it as a dynamic and also if you go to static ip address you can mention your IP address related things and uh, PPOE if you go here if you just wanted to uh, directly connect okay without fail okay once the router is on uh, directly if you wanted to log in into your internet service then you can go to PPOE under connection type then you can give your username and password and uh, re uh, retype password so it will connect by default you no need to connect every time if you are a ACT customer or a Hathaway customer whatever may be you have to log in into your home page every time so you no need to do that by default your router is going to take care all the things all the settings and DNS things you can do Mac address you can do it channel and SSID uh, settings you can do here and security related things uh, you can you can give security related thing uh, this is your uh, Wi-Fi password Wi-Fi password you can keep it here and if we click uh, on abstract PSK you can see it in uh, words and digits and Wi-Fi protect setup you can do here Wi-Fi protect uh, setup so all kind of uh, settings you can follow and you can you can do all kind of uh, settings here all kind of utilities everything uh, we are ha we are having here so i hope uh, this video will helpful for you so thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe our channel for more videos look forward i am going to do a lot of technical videos thank you so much